So next up, I'm not going to delve on this too much, but uh, Coinbase, I've uh, had my problems with them in the past because they keep breaking down at the most inopportune times when Bitcoin goes up at like 500 bucks or something like that. For some reason, multi-billion dollar company can't handle it. They've only been around for, I don't know, five plus years. Whatever. So, but there are some good things. First of all, I haven't heard about them crashing recently, so that's a plus. And second of all, uh, they will give you money just for learning about new cryptocurrencies. And you don't have to like trade or do anything like that. It's like you can get up to 115 bucks. So they have a new one. It's called Cello or Cello. I, I can't, I can't, I'm really bad with names. You can go in there and you can watch these videos, answer a couple questions. It probably takes like 10 minutes max and you get paid for it. And then you can do it for all different types. Like you can do it for Tezos. You can do it for Comp. You can do it for well, a ton of other stuff. So if you're looking, first of all, who doesn't have a Coinbase account? Everybody's got a Coinbase account, right? But one thing I want to make mention is the bummer of it all is things like this. Like I still have Tezos on there and they have an estimated reward of 4%, which I think is pretty decent, I guess. I'm sure I can get it more somewhere else if I uh, use a baker. But uh, that works out pretty well and I'm lazy. I don't want to do anything with it. So there it sits, right? But there's other parts that just suck. And this is one of them. USD coin rewards, 0.15%. I think that's still better than the banks. Correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, it's paltry compared to what you can get over at Celsius or Voyager or BlockFi or any of those other ones that you mean you can really get really great rewards. So always look for the positives, the negatives for everything that you look at, right? There is no black and white. There's a lot of gray areas. So Coinbase, if you're new, it's fantastic. Super simple. The fees suck, but you can also use Coinbase Pro. And that's not so bad. But if you're looking for like interest rates and things like that, you can't do better than other places such as Celsius and Voyager and whoever else you want to use. Me personally, I just believe in the Celsius. I believe in that mission. I believe in the person behind it, Alex Mashinsky. So I'm a big fan. Uh, Voyager, uh, we've had the CEO, Steve Ulrich on, and uh, I believe in that too. That's why they're my one-two punch. All right. So continuing on with that theme, we had actually Alex Mashinsky on the show yesterday, and there were some lingering questions that I'm going to clear up right now in Q of the day. So let's jump in the office. 